so I just got back from the Louvre and it was super cool but I came home because it started pouring rain and I needed to change because it was super uncomfortable and I was wearing so I had a big hoodie on I'll show you guys outside the window right now it's raining but I quickly wanted to thank Parade for sponsoring today's vlog because that's also something I'm going to be changing into because Parade is just so comfortable and um, I'm trying to be the epitome of comfort right now. So I feel like for a lot of us finding underwear that's actually semi-comfortable is really hard because like it's either riding up there, itchy, like there's just so many things that could go wrong. But Parade is genuinely so comfortable. Like, I honestly forget I'm wearing underwear most of the time because I just feel like I... I mean, I feel like I'm wearing underwear, but it's just, like, that comfortable is basically what I'm saying. Parade really does make something for everyone with their different types of fabrics and their amazing size range. Their size inclusivity goes from 3XL and is expanding even more in the new year, so that's super exciting. I don't know any other company that does something like that. They're also super affordable, starting at $8 a pair. Very doable very affordable and all of parade's projects are sustainably made which we love this is to, <laughs> to support uh sustainable companies so so i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys some of the items that i got from the parade website and brought with me on my trip i think my favorite style of underwear is the seamless thong i think this is the seamless thong i got it in a bunch of different colors i got some nudes because i don't really have any nude underwear it's good for like lighter pants and stuff this navy color which i really like the fabric is literally just so soft it's probably one of my favorite things about parade underwear is the fabric it that's I, what makes it so comfortable in my opinion i find seamless ones are very comfortable to begin with but the fabric is just incredible yeah and it's amazing that it's all sustainable as well and then this is the more cheeky version. These ones are a little more high-waisted too, I feel like. And I got it in this olive color. And I got this very cute bralette. If you don't know, they have bralettes as well. Very comfortable. This one's like a v-neck one. And I love the mesh with stripes. And I got this pair of underwear. This is also a thong. I get everything in a small, extra small. What's it called? It's like this moss color and it matches the green in here so i probably wear these together but this is more like a micro mesh and then i got two more bralettes that i want to show you i got that same one micro mesh one but in the classic black love and then i got this one because i love this style as well from like more comfier doesn't really matter what i'm wearing over top little bralette vibe and then there's micro mesh at the back and I like these because they have adjustable little facets at the back so depending on your band size which is great because a lot of bralettes don't do that but yeah that's what I got from parade I love everything I'm going to change into this bralette right now and I think maybe the black seamless underwear I just feel very cozy and confident when I'm wearing parade and I mean I feel like that's the ideal goal out of undergarments. Another thing about Parade that I've always loved is that they have always donated 1% of all orders to several nonprofit organizations, so I think that's really important to note. But yeah, again, thank you so much Parade for sponsoring today's video, and I think we all should be shopping Parade for our undergarments, so link will be down below. Hello everyone, welcome to Europe Vlog, woo! So, I'm starting the vlog quite late. Lighting's way better this way. I'm in London, but I leave tomorrow. I didn't vlog London. This is basically my intro saying I didn't vlog at London because it was a lot of family time, like with Lucas family and stuff. I just like wasn't trying to vlog. I was like adjusting to the time, blah, blah, blah. But tomorrow we're going to Paris and I'm going to vlog Paris. It's going to be great. I just took pictures in this super puff from Aritzia. Literally so warm. It got so cold here as soon as we got here. So I've been freezing. But this has been saving me. Um, anyway, I just took pictures in it because I'm doing um, a post with them on the Instagram. If you're not already, follow me. But I'm going to go meet Luca in Soho because we're going to get some Christmas gifts. Get a massage later. I'm honestly, like, feeling a little sick. Like, my throat. 
I'm really scared. I don't think it's COVID. I did like a self swab test and it came out negative, but I think it just might be a cold from like the drastic change in weather for me because it was like really drastic. It was like super cold, but I wasn't used to it. Anywho, I gotta go because I'm late. I'm like sweating in the shower. I'm gonna change because it's not this cold today. This is our hotel. It's very cute. It's like a little futuristic vibe. Anyway, I have to go. But yeah, I just want to say hi. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. We are moved hotels because our first hotel was horrible. And now we're Lucas in the Louis Vuitton store. I am not. Um, I am vlogging in the middle of public. It's really hot. We're staying very close to this cafe, which a lot of people recommend it. Um, but I haven't been. Now Luke is coming at the store.
We're in Paris. Oh my god, I sound really sick. <laughs> I am kind of sick. I am sick. <laughs> I'm very stuffed up and I'm very clogged up. All my sinuses. It's especially bad because I just woke up. Luca went to go work out and he ordered me some tea. So that was nice. Now I need to straighten my hair because I took a shower and then I went outside with wet hair and that never works out for me. It was also raining. It's like raining all week, which is like really annoying. But I love it here. I'm living all my dreams. I'm very happy. I've been eating some really good food. I love French food. But yeah, we're here till Wednesday and then we go to Italy to see Luca's family. And then I go home. I'm so excited to go home. Y'all have no idea. But it is bright and early. It's like 8 a.m. And I'm getting ready. Uh oh. <laughs> this doesn't plug in here. I hate having to like get two adapters and shit. Staying at, I don't really want to show you the hotel room because it's kind of a mess. But we're staying at Bellamy Hotel and it's actually really nice. We were staying at a different hotel and it wasn't, so we had to, we switched hotels. But I really like this hotel. It's very, it's the perfect amount of like niceness for me. Not too bougie, not too not. <laughs> yeah. Um, okay, I am going to reconvene when I'm a little more awake. Mm -hmm.